Hello and welcome to Train Sim TV. In this video, we're going to be taking a look at a new scenario for the on track simulation Harrogate Loop version 2. The scenario is from Str uh, Strange Chris and it's available on Alan Thompson Simulation. Both links are in the description for you guys to download if you wish to do so. Um, let's get straight into this one. It's a short 30 minute run, it's a bit of a shunt move. We're going to take this unit here to the train care depot at York. So we're going to go via Holgate on that and then we're just going to go and park it up in stable. Um, up. Something I've not done actually on the route either, um, having made the route, um, so it's nice to come and uh, find, a, find a scenario for it. So, yeah, let's get it unpaused, let's get set up, and uh, let's get underway. So, we're just going to unpause the game there, go straight to the cab. Um, just go through the briefing straight away in this one. It's a uh, good evening driver. The unit in front of you has just been detached and will go forward to Liverpool Working 1 Papa 92. Uh, you've just arrived to take this unit onto the depot. Get set up and depart when the signals allow. You've been reversing, uh, no, sorry, you'll be reversing in Holgate Yard to access the depot. As you're the on, uh, only an ECS, you'll not uh, be the highest of priority, and there'll be plenty of other traffic about today. Good luck, and the Axiom code is 997 GSMR is 236, date 2007 in October, and that max speed is nowhere near what we're going to be getting to, but it's 100 mile an hour. Right, so unpause and we'll get the key in into neutral. There we go. Uh, it was triple nine. Hang on, I'll do that. I'll uh, activate that first, actually. Hang on. There we go. Look at that tick. There we go. We can do that now. So triple nine seven. Do the GSMR as well. Once it's powered up. There we go. So five Papa ninety two and two three six for the signal. Uh, we'll get some lighting on as well. Instrument lights on, like so, and pretty much good to go. Dear on there, we'll leave it in neutral. So what we'll do now, whilst we're waiting, uh, we'll do a bit of training spotting. There's a little bit to see, so I will stop talking for a few minutes and let you guys sit back and enjoy the trains.
Right, so let's get ourselves going. We have a single yellow currently. Let's get ourselves moving uh, towards the next signal at the end of the station. So the general reason I wanted to do this as a little video is I've literally just been away to York for a few days um, with work, so still quite fresh in the mind. Uh, always enjoy going to York, so having spent a bit of time on the station, uh, catching various bits and pieces, especially the 68s as well, um, it was just nice to come do this for a video. Um, loving the, the variety of uh, AI colours as well in the liveries, it's a good, uh, good time for the railway liveries. There's all sorts of about. I mean, some of my favourites as well. You've got First Northwestern there. You've even got the red and silver Metro Northern colours as well. I do like them liveries. So we're not going to race off too much here. We're just going to wait and see what this next signal is at the end of the platform. Um, we're going to be going to Holgate Loop, which is just under a mile. It's not a long uh, journey. We're going to cross over and then we'll do our change of ends. There's all sorts of knocking about this evening. Uh, it's quarter to nine in the game time, and we do have a red currently as well. Lovely sunset as well. I'm just waiting for one at five, eight to arrive as well, so I assume once he comes in, we should get the road and we can go. If you may clear it by the time we get to the signal, we'll just crawl up to it. There we go. So really as well, I mean, it's a little bit out of date um, for this, well, too too far forward in the future really for this scenario. I mean, the rock center was never there uh, in 2007. So you just got to be a little bit... Uh, Close the eyes and just forget it, basically. Imagine what it once was. There's a 60 there as well, waiting to get the uh, road through, which I suppose is probably waiting for us to cross over. Certainly lower down the pecking order than what we are. <clears throat> Leave it neutral now because it's 25 into the uh, into the loop itself. No point making more work for us to speed up to slow back down again. Make sure we uh, clear the signal as well before we start stopping. We'll put the brakes on now. No point going all the way down the actual uh, line. I've still not put my branding pack on these wagons. I must do it, maybe one day. However, probably to be fair now, I might as well just wait because um, new PC will be arriving soon enough. So no point installing loads of stuff when well, I've got to reinstall it again. So right, there we go. Right. So we'll uh, we'll shut this end down. Everything shut down there. Should we not pop up? Just tell me I've changed cabs. So I'm just going to acknowledge that again. Uh, oh, I'm gone. Travel nine seven once more. Uh, this time we are going to be at signal two one one. So five Papa ninety. Oh, what am I doing here? P ninety two. 
is two double one and tick. Empty the depot on there. We've got them on. We need to put that on. There we go. So I say we're just waiting for the road now um, before we head into the yard itself. Uh, we're not due in there for a bit of time yet, so again, most likely going to be waiting for some trains. So I'm going to stop talking once more. I'm going to let you guys enjoy the, uh, the trains going by before we uh, get the road to continue once more. Right, so we've got the road. We're going via platform 10 uh, for this next section. So we'll put ourselves into forward, DRA off, and away we go. <clears throat> that light's starting to fade a bit now as we press on into the evening. Only 10 minutes have passed, obviously, since we'd like arrived here. May not seem it, but obviously, a bit of, uh, bit of async and a bit of. Uh, different filming views and angles there makes it a little bit more interesting what I like about these sort of short snows because you can do a little bit of driving a little bit of, um, bit of spotting if you will change it up a little bit up to 25 now Some cool work and coming down here as well as a uh, 67 dragging there Something's gone wrong. It's quite cool. Evening lights all now come on in the station. Hoping we've got the road here. I'm going to slow it down a little bit. It's nice to see the rework lights here as well. Uh, it's not something to see very often. Uh, we haven't got the off indicator, so we must know we haven't. We've got a banner repeater against us there, so we'll start taking off power. Well, we do. We're all right. We've got the uh, shunt signal. Grand Central set just coming over there as well. In, uh, over Lehman Road there and just uh, on the left we've got National Railway Museum or as I like to call it the other day was the NRN Mark was getting a bit annoyed with me <laughs> no idea why I kept calling it NRN it was just because of messing around with NRNs on TS but it stuck in my head 
What a Burke moment. <clears throat> I'm going to leave it at 15 because 15 limit in the actual depot itself and we do need to stop at the stop board which is uh, just coming up in a moment just at the entrance to the depot. We've got, uh, got the road there into the line to the yard itself. This is the first for me. I've not driven in here yet, so finally got around to doing it. Not sure if there's some, yeah, there will be some manual point work, most likely. There we go. I'm just going to stop at the uh, board here, await further instruction. Shunter, hello driver of 5 Papa 92 standing at the stop board. Uh, you're clear to enter the depot, but make sure you set all the manual points correctly. Stop in LMD 2 before reversing into the stable and siding 1. Shunter out. Okie doke. Right, let's go and do that first. So, we need to be over here. So, we can uh, continue over the top line there. Set that... There. So everything's actually set for us there, so we don't have to do any faffing about as such here. So we're clear to proceed into the yard itself. What I'm going to do also is potentially, potentially get a screenshot with that sign in the background. Although it probably won't work. Go to plan. There may actually be if I pause the game a second. I think there's another sign around here. However. That could work quite nicely, I think. I will take a screenshot here, however, just in case there's a backup. Although I don't think the lighting really does it justice, to be quite fair. So we'll go with that one. That is, that is backup. <laughs> I'm not overly keen with that. RHTT oh, should have gone past there as well. Top and tail mucky 20s. <clears throat> so we'll pull all the way down here and then we'll do another change of ends. Set the points as well before we proceed. So doing this is quite cool because um, when we left York the other day I actually drove down the road that goes under the bridge next to where we are. So I literally come out of the NRN and uh, to leave we actually came down here and uh, off we went on the ring road. So it's quite cool to do this especially when we drive nearby in the car as well. Right, lights are off, and same with the instrument lights. Let's get all them off. Everything uh, can be stayed off now. We don't need any of that. Um, change of ends. Let's just cancel that. Let's just tell me I've always changed ends again. Well, everything's already ticked up here. We'll get some night lights on. Uh, desk lights again. I won't do the GSMR now, we're obviously out of here. And I'll leave the actual... Actually, no, I will set that, actually. Because that would make it a little bit nicer in the screenshot. I'll leave that bit on. Right. I 
think I should just cancel that. I'm messing with the key. Enjoy you know what we haven't done? We haven't done the points. So we'll do them now. And we're in the middle line. No, we're not on the outer line, sorry. So we'll change that and we are good to go. So we'll blast the, uh, the horn there. Just to let any workers know that we are travelling. So we'll try for the screenshot as well. Hopefully the winning screenshot that is. So I want to be somewhere around here. So you get all the trains, you get the sign, we get the lot. Definitely a better view. You've got better lighting on this. I know. So we've got that nice little pink uh, tinge in the distance as the sun goes down. There's a bit more going on this side. What we'll do is we'll pause it about there. Take that screenshot so let it just sort itself out for a second because otherwise the game just stutters like mad. There we go. And we'll get back in the cab because otherwise we'll end up going all the way through the buffers and that'll just be video pointless. But that is virtually stabling a 185 at York. Just a nice little uh, easy simple video and a nice easy scenario to end the day on as well. There we go. Excellent stuff. So I hope you enjoyed that, guys. Engine off. Excellent stuff. I'm just going to pause that there for a second. So thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed that. And it's a nice little scenario. Uh, links in the description below um, for the route and scenario itself. And also, I will put the link in there for the 185 if you, uh, again, wish to go and purchase that. Uh, that's also available from Alan Thompson Simulation. Thanks for watching, guys. Take it easy, and we will see you again on the next video very soon. Goodbye. Cheers. Thank you.